Welcome back to Underwater Math. I'm Launch with Comet My Spacer Dog. Today we're fishing in space, relating angles to circular measurement. As we know, angles are formed when two rays share a common endpoint. Angles are measured in degrees. To understand degrees, we will use a line segment in a circle. If we rotate the line segment all the way around, it rotates 360 degrees. A circle is 360 degrees. One degree is a very small degree of a turn. It is one degree out of 360 degrees. A one degree turn. Wowza, I have a bite. A 90 degree angle has 91 degree turns. It is 90 degrees out of 360 degrees. It also looks like what fraction of a circle? That's right, one fourth. A 90 degree angle is one fourth of a turn. 90 degrees over 360 degrees or simplified to one fourth. Whoa. Who knew angles and circles were so closely related? Check out what angle I just caught. Let's look at this acute, 40 degree angle. Since it measures 40 degrees, it has 41 degree turns out of 360. It also is less than one fourth of a turn. Great angling. Check this one out. It measures 120 degrees, an obtuse angle. It has 121 degree turns. It is more than one fourth of a turn, but less than one half of a turn. It looks to be one third of a circle. Oh, I caught a problem. A water sprinkler rotates one degree at each interval. If the sprinkler rotates a total of 85 degrees, how many one degree turns has the sprinkler made? Hmm, it's made 85 one degree turns. Each turn is one degree out of 360. Nice catch Comet. Thanks for building up your angler skills. Don't forget about angles and circles. Keep practicing.